Hey guys, Nebris here. Welcome back to another episode of Crack Pack. Today, we get started on Applied Energistics. Yay. Wait, I only needed one? Huh, that's news to me. Oh well, that's okay. No big deal. We have a charger! I know I don't know if this needs power, but I'm gonna assume the answer is yes because it's taking power right now. Um Hold up. Do I have chests already made? I do not. Where'd my wood go? Give me that back. Give me that back. I feel like this is going to be an episode where I'm doing a lot of things that, like, I'll do something and then I'll have to, like, leave for a while and then I'll come back to do the next thing. Um, just because it takes a long time for stuff to charge and to inscribe. But I'm going to do what I can for now. Um, I want to make some servos. This will take me a quick second. There we go. And a pair of item ducts. I have plenty of those. Uh, no, that's not where I wanted it. End of the world. There we go. So this should allow me to make charged Certus Quartz. Let me give it a shot. It's working. So this charges fairly quickly enough. Maybe I'm being a bit overly dramatic. Um, next up on our list of things to make is an inscriber. I already have one of these. I think I'm... There's an automatic version of the machine. Let's see what that's like. Um, I think it's not applied energistics. It's like, uh, something else. So let's just Google it. Google inscriber. This is what I'm looking for. AE2 stuff is the mod. So... I'm going to need the inscribers plus the things that they make, so I'm going to need to make inscribers regardless. Let's, uh, let's go ahead and make two more of these things. Um, and I already have some pre-made or pre-charged crystals because I, I found more than the two I started with anyhow. All right, let's head back over here. We need slime balls. Have I been collecting them? I've got six of these miniature hearts. I think I'm gonna need, like, I have four more here to go that are red, and then I'm gonna need another 10 red ones, and then 10 yellow ones to start on the yellow ones. So I think maybe it, it is wise to just make these. Let's do that now. Uh, maybe not. Let's get four apples. Because I, I like having extra hearts. Hearts are really nice to have. And... Aluminum. Let's do this. I kind of feel like I'm wasting the yellow ones, but I'm f I'm probably gonna get yellow ones faster than I'll get the red ones, because the yellow ones I can get from Withers, and I can just get as many of those as I like. In fact, I could make a single yellow heart container using these yellow hearts, and I might even do that as well. I came in here for sticky, for gelatinous slime. Let's take eight of these. I don't want to use the pink slime I have over there, but it's an option. And you know what? 
let's actually make a butt ton of redstone. Or redstone pistons. Uh, 16. There, a butt ton of pits, pistons has been manufactured and they're all sticky now. Ew. We'll put the extra ones. Ah, oh, let's put them here. They're actually quite useful there. Uh, inscriber, the rest is iron. Let's, uh, let's actually just grab it from here. All right, we have four inscribers now. Yay. Do these take power? Yes, they do. Um, let's let's move this guy. We do like having this guy here. Let's put it right there. Um, I guess we'll put our inscriber set up right here. I think. You know, I really only need one of these at the moment. I'll just switch the stuff in and out. Um, start making chests. You know, screw it. <laughs> We're gonna make a bunch of chests. So many chests you wouldn't believe. Oh, they don't need to be special chests. No, they do not. Um, but I am gonna need gonna need more servos. Let's let's just make the whole lot of these. I find Invar is, is good enough of a level of servo to make for what I need. Uh, Sixteen at a time is is plenty enough. It, it's a lot better than iron, though. Iron is not enough to meet my servo demands. Um, oh, we can almost get rid of that, but not quite. All right, how do I want to do this? So I have this here. Ooh, I might want to move that because that scared the crap out of me. I'm not gonna lie. Sardis quartz crystals, that's almost done. Um, I don't like, if I put this here, have an output there, one thing from the side, one thing from the bottom, and an outlet, hmm. Okay, yeah, that's what I'll do. Let's grab some item ducks, some resident flux ducks, and let's come all the way over here. And let's not break this anytime soon. How does one remove this? <laughs> no. Do I harvest it with an axe? Like, what's going on here? It's not harvestable. What does this even mean? Not harvestable. This is bull. I, I want it. <laughs> I want this thing gone. Drop base. Wow. I didn't know I had to Skrillex this thing. <laughs> I think it's it's time we got rid of these. And why I don't know why I am getting rid of these in the worst possible way. That said, I'm really enjoying this ring of magnetization. Alright. Let's go ahead, place you. I'm really ashamed of that Skrillex joke. Not really. I'm actually kinda of proud of it. <laughs> don't tell anyone though. Cause that's what pride and shame are. <laughs> uh, 
Okay, so I think this is how it is done. We're going to add one here, one here, one here, and one here. And I would very much like to put this here, but you know what? Yeah, I could do that just fine. We could have this. This will be an, a double output chest of justice. And I can always also keep this stuff here as well. So I put stuff here, stuff here, and stuff here. Oh, one of these is is going to be the the press. So let's just say we start with silicon. That's going to go in the top, so I guess I don't need this top part. Silly me for thinking I needed the top part. Uh, I'm trying to think of how I might want to improve this now that I know that I don't need the top part. But that's okay. Um, next up... Oh, I hate it when I do that. Engineering, calculation, logic. This is gold. This is Certus Quartz. This is a diamond. Let's go ahead and place this guy in here. Yeah. Alrighty, so I think what I need to do is get silicon, and I don't have silicon. Silicone, silicon. Which is it? How does one make it? Silicon. No, that's not. This is what I'm looking for. Yeah, let's put this in the pulverizer. It seems rather silly. We'll clean up our inventory in the meantime. Done with the ender lilies for now. Actually, someone else might want these. Let's let's put them like if we had a something to do for trading, we would put them in a trading exchange, but we don't have one of those. So oh well. We'll just have to suffer through. Okay, so if, if I want Okay, so that's all I really need to do. And it's not coming out. Why is it not coming out? Is that why it's not coming out? That's why it wasn't coming out. Sweet. All right, so this is just going to make a whole bunch of stuff. And that's a cool thing. Um, so I think that's all I'll do for today. Thank you guys for watching. And next time I'm going to, you know, get... I, I'm just going to make all the resources I'm going to need going forward for setting up the IE system. Actually, before we leave, um, I don't know if I've done too much since I've left. I think I just completed the walls and then maybe added uh, these two doors, which I'm kind of happy with. Although I might not keep them where they are at the moment. Because I don't know if I want this uh, passage here. Especially if it's only going to be able to support this one very thin wall. And one thing I'm thinking about doing is... Since I kind of do want this window here... Um, I think I want to make a setup where... Maybe there's an entrance here and then like a window here that looks into the room but you can't get into the room from the window so kind of like a stargate observation deck sort of thing and then there's the, the portal there because this thing eventually becomes a portal if i'm correct so maybe this door might have to get moved maybe it maybe it would make more sense to have it here anyway in the corner or maybe not at all although this place would look pretty crappy without a door here somewhere It'd just be a giant empty wall, which it is at the moment. 
which is, and it's also evenly spaced, this emptiness. Maybe I'll just move it over one. That'll probably solve my problems either way. Um, so yeah, the A room is going to go back in here, so I still have to dig all this out because it's going to be underneath this place. And up here, I guess I'll just have like a, a power generation area. And over here, maybe, will be my labs. Maybe I'll have them sticking out of the side of this place so I can observe the world around me. And of course, the launching station will be up here. But my A2 system and auto crafting will be down over here. Um, I'm gonna have to make some deep storage units and some cashews for that. <clears throat> so yeah, that's gonna be it for today, guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time.